What's going on everyone, it's Mark Ohana, and the last video I posted, I reviewed this guy right here, the Nexus 6, after three months of fully using it as my primary daily driver, and a lot of you agreed with me about the battery life issues, about the software issues, and just the things that really deterred this phone down, because it's a great phone on paper, it has a lot of flagship specs and big bold letters, but it just didn't live up to all of its glory, and this video is actually a little bit more in its favor, because it's all about these software improvements and how much that's changed my experience with the brand new Google Nexus 6 with say Android 5.0.1 that was released to this guy, the Nexus 6. So let's go ahead and dive into the improvements with the software and also if it actually affected any of the hardware. So first things first, nothing's really aesthetically different with 5.0.1. It's more of a software patch in terms of fixing all the bugs that were initially on the Google Nexus 6 with Android 5 and a lollipop. So in terms of smoothness and apps not crashing anymore, I really haven't run into that problem anymore since updating my phone. And that's a good thing. No more crashes, no more apps not working the way they should be. A lot of more third-party applications are actually working now. And that might be due to the 5.0 upgrade in terms of their own applications sending those updates to their applications, or I should say the developers sending updates to their applications. But other than that, all the Google applications are working perfectly fine right now. I still have a little problem of Hangouts crashing, or really when I open it, it just doesn't format correctly. I'm not exactly sure why. I've even restored my phone, completely factory reset it, and I still have that problem. I'm not sure if anyone else is having that problem, but other than that, it's exactly the same. One other minor thing that I've seemed to notice a little bit more after using 5.0.1 is the improved speed in terms of animations. Now, I'm not sure that I'm seeing things because I've kind of looked back at my old footage with just normal 5.0, and it seems like the animations have kind of been sped up a little bit just to make it a more pleasing experience in terms of not waiting for those animations to roll out and, you know, do their course. It just seems a little faster with 5.0.1. Now, one thing I was really pushing for with this update was improved battery life endurance with this Nexus 6 because because if you remember my review, I really just didn't like it. I didn't get anything over four hours of on-screen time, and obviously I should have because it's a huge battery. I know it's a Quad HD display, but that's not really an excuse because the Galaxy Note 4 has a huge battery, a huge display, and those many pixels, and it does just fine on battery life while the Nexus 6 does not. Now, 5.0.1, I honestly haven't seen a giant difference. Uh, I might have been able to get about four hours of on-screen time at maximum. That's it's not minimum, at maximum, about four hours of on-screen time. And again, I leave my phone on auto brightness. It's usually dim because I'm always inside. Uh, and it's just, it's just not very good. I don't know why. It, they just need to improve it somehow. Uh, I mean, the battery life or the battery size itself is huge. I just don't see why the battery life itself really sucks. The Living with the update has been exactly the same as Living with Android 5.0 Lollipop when it first was out with the Nexus 6. And I mean, I can't really complain about the experience. It's just really good. Uh, the biggest complaint still exists about battery life. But other than that, it's pretty good. So this is kind of an update video. I'm almost out of this challenge because I have one or two more things to really mention in a video. But other than that, make sure to leave some comments below. I definitely want to start a discussion here. And as always, my name is Mark Ohana, and I'll catch you guys in the next video.